Hey guys, how are you guys doing today? I am back with a pregnancy video. I haven't done one of these videos since like my first trimester recap. So this is of course my second trimester recap and I am 34 weeks today. And yes, you guys, I did change my hair. I went a bit darker um, just because my hair was becoming a mess <laughs> pretty much <laughs> so i did get a haircut and i did dye it black what do you guys think do you think it looks better this color or the how i had it before comment down below in today's video i'm going to be sharing with you some essentials that i've been using for my second trimester along with some gifts that i've been receiving anyway so i told you guys last time that i was using the app called baby center to uh, keep track of my pregnancy so i'm 34 weeks today and in the app today it says let's see what the app says so it says i have 39 days to go you guys and uh my baby and my baby is the size of a cantaloupe the baby weighs four pounds about the size of a cantaloupe and it's almost 18 inches long can you believe that 18 inches oh my goodness that is <laughs> for me that is pretty long <laughs> Um, especially for my size I'm like fine one her fat layers which will help regulate her body temperature once she's born are filling her up making her rounder her skin is almost smoother than ever her central nervous system is maturing and her lungs are continuing to mature as well I really like this app because it shows you videos you guys it shows you videos each week and it just tells you how your baby's doing and what to expect I'm like so excited you guys 34 weeks I can't believe it I have six more weeks to go and i just can't wait i just can't wait anyway so we are going to continue on to this video um i'm going to show you guys some of the stuff that we got for the baby well mostly stuff that i received because we did recently have our gender reveal at um our second trimester so i I mean, it, I, I didn't ask for, it, for any of our friends to give us anything, um, but they did bring some gifts. Especially Sarah, because she's my best friend and she's the one that organized the whole thing. So, let's see. I'm gonna show you guys. Ah, a little. Hold on, chop something. These are the items that I received. Look how cute they are, you guys. Look how freaking cute they are. Oh my goodness. Ugh. This is just so cute. This is for a newborn, so this is definitely something that she's gonna wear like maybe out the hospital. And this is three to nine months, so she may be wearing this for a little over. But look how cute they are. I love this bunny, the polka dot, and of course, more bunnies. <laughs> I wonder if she's gonna be born before or after easter i have a feeling she's gonna be born like like on easter she also received this bath set it looks like this this is so stinking cute and <laughs> lots of little mittens you guys look how cute these mittens are look at this cute little hat i think this goes with the with these onesies <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness you guys look how freaking cute these are and yeah it does go with the onesies because the hat in the back right here has the same pattern as this first onesie so i can imagine that the middle hat right here the second one goes with this one so cute oh, i'm just so excited you can't forget the little socks look how small they are they're so tiny this little traveler kit um this is for a car or a stroller i love the color it's so pretty my friend came from california to visit me and <laughs> look what she made for the baby little band little headband and look at this one look how cute they are you guys and of course this is the white one again well, the ivory one. How freaking cute, you guys. I need to stop saying that. I mean, I feel like I say that word a bit too much. Moving along to things that I 
Okay, now moving on. I'm sorry, I'm like losing my breath. But now moving along to things that we bought for the baby. This is the first thing I've ever bought for a baby. And it says, um, this is just a little picture frame. And it says, hashtag my first selfie. And there she is, you guys. Isn't she adorable? <sighs> so excited. I'm just so excited to meet her, seriously. I'm just... I'm like counting the days right now because like I'm in my third trimester and I'm like struggling. <laughs> so I want to see her already. I want to meet her already. And by the way, we uh, we also bought the crib back there. I'll give you a closer look of the crib. Um, but those balloons up there are from the baby shower. So we recently had the baby shower as well last weekend. So if you guys want to see a video, also if you guys want to see like the gifts that we received for the baby shower, go ahead and comment below and I will do that video for you guys. And I really want to show you guys the baby shower because it was it was just full of surprises. It was supposed to be a surprise baby shower, but I ended up, well the person planning the baby shower told me like a week before <laughs> or like a few weeks before the baby shower. So that was really interesting. <laughs> <laughs> but it was fun I loved it it was really really nice another thing that I bought for my baby are these books you guys I've been reading to her it feels so nice to just read to her at night and these are the books that I've been reading to her I got these books from the Dollar Tree you guys you can actually find really good hardcover books at the Dollar Tree and they're really inexpensive of course they're only a dollar so the books I got her were Noah's, Noah's Ark and this one's actually really nice because it's a pop-out uh, storybook. So look at it. Look how the characters just pretty much pop out. <laughs> it's adorable. Oh my goodness. How sweet. I've also been reading to her First Steps in the Bible, First Steps to God, and first steps and faith. If you guys wanted to read to your baby, obviously you don't want to spend a lot of money on it, on a, bot a bunch of books, because I know for sure, when she's out the belly, she's gonna probably rip these books apart. So if you don't want to spend that money, um, go to Dollar Tree and get you some really inexpensive books for them to read and of course for yourself so you can read to them moving along to my essentials you guys i'm not being paid to endorse a sponsor or anything um with this company but i did reach out to them and i told them that i was in love with their product just because honestly i am in love with their product so they did send me more but i did purchase it with my own money at first then i reached out to them and i told them that i love it they sent me a box you guys with their goodies and i am just so happy i'm so thankful that they sent it to me because honestly i haven't received i don't think i've ever received anything from a company just by telling them that i love their product so that was really nice that was really nice of them and of course i needed more product because homegirl it was running out okay so this is the the product i was telling you guys that i completely love this is the palmer's tummy butter for stretch marks i completely love it you guys it smells delicious it doesn't have any parabens and it doesn't have any mineral oils as well which i totally live for i'm trying to use items that don't have a lot of chemicals but that also works uh, well with my skin and will break me out because i do have very sensitive skin you guys and i tend to break out using um products that have a lot of chemicals so i'm just so happy that this actually worked with my skin and that it's a great company um also i did start using this later on but this is the palmer's cocoa butter formula with vitamin e skin therapy oil and my goodness you guys i completely love this i apply this after i apply my tummy butter it just gives me extra moisture and i honestly live for that feeling because i don't know what it is maybe it's because my baby is growing really quickly but i was very thin before i got pregnant i was like 115 i honestly didn't have a lot of belly fat if 
that makes sense um so when i started getting really big quickly my skin felt like it was like about to tear because it it just felt really really dry and it was like expanding so as soon as i started using this like it just feels so much better because i also used to use other lotions but the moisturizing feeling will like go away really quickly and since this one's a heavier cream and this is a heavier of course it's a butter um it like it stays on for longer and i actually can keep this for the whole day you guys until like i take a shower or, or bathe pretty much so I really love it. I totally recommend this to you guys. Another essential that I've been loving, you guys, are these maternity pants. Why? Because my whole first trimester and like the beginning of my second trimester, I was pretty much living in leggings, which was okay, you know, because it was cold. And honestly, when it's really cold, I don't feel like dressing up. <laughs> but um, I just got to the point where I'm like, I actually want to start looking good, you know, I want to be looking presentable <laughs> while I'm pregnant. So I went ahead and got me some maternity pants and you guys like I looked seriously, I looked everywhere for cute maternity pants and I couldn't find any cute that would actually fit me. So I went into H&M you guys and look what I found. So I got these maternity pants and they were actually on sale you guys. Like I did not know that my H&M doesn't carry maternity clothing in stores so apparently they only carry it online they told me to go to the uh, sell section that they might have some in the sell section and I, I was so happy because I found I actually found three pairs I found this gray ones that look like this they're so nice I wish I could like model them for you guys but this is this is pretty much how they look and they're very very comfortable you guys they're really stretchy so i got i got this pair of course in gray and i got another pair in black and i didn't end up getting the third pair because it was like a dark denim i don't wear dark denim at all so just decided not to get that one and just get two pairs and they actually fit really really well you guys like they lift your butt I know it's ridiculous that I'm saying this, but it does. It looks good on your butt. <laughs> and I got it in the size 6. So if you guys are about my size right now, I can't believe this, but you guys are not going to believe how much I weigh right now. <laughs> I weigh 158 for 115. But hey, it's all for the baby. I'm not complaining. <laughs> but um, I wear a size 6. You guys, I'm like... So close so close to my due date that I'm at the point right now that I can't sleep because I'm so excited about the baby but I also can not like I cannot get comfortable <laughs> I constantly have to be turning like, in, like all night and apparently you can't sleep on your back and I am a back sleeper. I'm a back and tummy sleeper. So this has been awful for me. So if you guys recommend any sleeping pillow, um, please let me know down below, like any maternity pillows, because honestly, uh, if you can't tell because I'm wearing all this makeup, I am really tired. <laughs> so let me know down below if you're a mommy or if you're pregnant and, and you've used maternity pillows just let me know down below which brand you guys use because i honestly need one right now and if not then i'm gonna go crazy because i love my sleep i almost forgot i have to show you my belly it's gotten really big this is the belly it's gotten really big since our first trimester recap are you guys ready <laughs> Pow! <laughs> Almost flashed you there, but um, this is the belly. You guys, my belly button has gotten huge. I have a really small belly button, so I'm kind of conscious of how my belly button looks, so do not judge it, please. But this is pretty much how it looks in the front. Like that. 
And then this is the side. My goodness, it's gotten so big. And the other side. Now that they see my belly, you guys, I hope you guys enjoy this video and I hope this video is not too long because I feel like I talked a lot. <laughs> so I need to stop rambling and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.